also open the Dream Girls one because I need to fix. Um, she's missing an arm. It starts with a flyer, then one click later, and it's lights, camera, action at the Murfreesboro Center for the Arts. We get a committee together and figure out which shows are hot, which shows would the community be interested in. Then they kind of get together and collectively decide which ones we should do. This building's been around so long that you used to be able to get books here too. It was built in 1904. Um, after the post office, then it was the Linball Library. And then about 20 years ago, they renovated it to be the Center for the Arts. Waiting out the winter may be the key to catching a play on its best day. January and February are usually a little bit slower just because of the weather, depending on what part of the country you are in. You definitely don't want to wait till the last minute because tickets for this theater, well, they sell out pretty fast. Excuse me. And I know you definitely want to get a good seat. 127 people can take a journey into the woods, sing along with the dream girls, or parents can have their kids learn how to do it like the pros. We also have youth programs, so we do a lot of um, engaged kids from 4 to 18 to teach them how to act, how to be involved in the theater. Um, so it's a wide range, really. Everyone in our community could be impacted by us. So next time you find yourself riding through the square, take a look at the People's Champ in live theater. For MTSU News 3, I'm DeMarco Moore.